Hey cuties, what's up and welcome back to my Roblox channel. Now before we get going, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. So in today's role playing video, I set my evil stepmom's house on fire. <laughs> Come in! Hey kiddo! Oh, hey dad! What are you doing? Oh, just watching some TikToks before bed. That's nice. Look, I wanted to talk to you about something. Yeah, what's up? I have a business trip tomorrow, and I will have to be out of town for a few days. Okay. Are you all right with me being gone after losing your mom? Yeah, sure. I'll be okay. Uh, am I staying at Sky? No, actually, uh, I thought you'd stay here. But who is going to watch me? I am too young to stay alone, Dad. That's the thing. You'll stay here with your stepmother. Oh. Is that okay? Yeah, but are you sure she knows how to take care of me? Of course she does, sweetie, and I'll just be a short phone call away. Do you have to go, Dad? I do. I'm so sorry. It's a big job I'm working on, and I can't pass it up. Okay, you don't have to worry about me, Dad. I'll be fine. Glad to hear it. I know you will be, and you and your stepmom will have so much fun. I guess so. I've never really been alone with her. Exactly. This will give the two of you some time to bond and just really get to know each other. Just wait. You'll have so much fun, you won't even notice that I'm gone. Okay, sounds good. Can I go back to watching TikToks now? No, it's a school night off to bed Ugh, fine the next day i'm gonna miss you so much dad i'm gonna miss you too my princess have fun on your business trip honey i will dear now i put the emergency numbers on the fridge and if you need anything at all just call sky's mom mackenzie knows the number but it's also on the fridge don't worry kenzie and i are gonna have so much fun these few days are going to fly by oh great i am so excited i love Fun. What are we gonna do? Well, I can't just spoil the surprise right now, can I? Oh, I love to see my two girls having fun and getting along. Well, I better be going now. I don't want to hit traffic. Mackenzie, you have so much fun and listen to your stepmother. I will, Dad. Have fun on your trip. Bye. Wow, I am so excited about all the fun we're gonna have. What do you want to do first? Oh, do you want to eat ice cream? <gasps> we can have a dance party. You can drop the act, you little brat. He's gone. What? I wasn't acting. Ugh, I thought he was never gonna leave. That was painful. So we're not going to have fun now? What's wrong with you? Are you dumb or something, or are you just acting? I thought we established that I wasn't acting. Don't you talk back to me, you little termite. And ew, get away from me. You're standing too close. Ugh, kids are disgusting. What is going on here? Why are you being so mean? What changed? Were you put under a spell or something? Ha <laughs> ha! Grow up, sweetheart. You may not have been acting, but I was. That whole nice spin was just an act in front of your father. What? But you're always so nice. Yeah, when he's here, I can't have him catching on to my plan. Why? What's your plan? To ship your little butt off to boarding school. Boarding school? You heard me, little missy. You are out of here. You can't do this. My dad will never, ever get rid of me. Well, your daddy isn't here now, is he? I don't get it. If you don't like kids, why did you marry my dad? Because he's rich. Duh. You don't really love him? Your dad? Ew, no. And once both of you are out of the picture, all of the money will be mine. <laughs> oh, how could you do this? Oh, easily. Now I will lock you up in the garage and you will stay there until it is time for you to leave for boarding school. You can't do this. You can't. Watch me. This is your new home until you get shipped off to school. So get used to it. Well, when can I ever come out? When this house burns down. I can't believe that this is happening to me. Dad, Dad, please come home. Meanwhile. I can't wait to see my bestie. I just can't wait. It's been almost 24 hours. I can't stand it. I'm coming, girly. Can I help you? Yeah. Hi, Mrs. Stepmom, ma'am. I don't think we've ever met before, but I'm Sky. I'm here to see Mackenzie. Oh, I'm sorry. Mackenzie have any visitors right now. Why? We're supposed to walk to school together. Oh, uh, um, she isn't feeling well today. She's gonna stay home. Is she sick? Oh, yeah, pretty sick. You know what? It might be something contagious, so if I were you, I'd leave. She didn't seem sick yesterday. Just came on this morning, I guess. Can I at least just check on her? For your own well-being, I'm afraid I can't allow that. Now, hurry off and go. You don't want to be late for school. Bye-bye.
A few moments later. later. What is going on here? When will I be able to get back inside of my house? Sorry, ma'am. You need to back up. This is an active fire. No, no, no. You don't understand. All of my makeup is in the house. My Chanel bags are in there. When can I go in? Well, I was trying to tell you that that is not really an option. Fire is too far out of control for us to manage. There is nothing we can do to save the house. We're really sorry, but it is rude. All of your things are destroyed. You. It's your fault, you little monster. You I thought you were mature enough to stay home with your stepmother. How could you let me down like this? I know. I am very disappointed in her, too. Hold up. You cannot believe her, Dad. She's evil. She's been planning to ship me up to boarding school, and the only reason she married you is for your money. She doesn't really love you, Dad. <laughs> oh, great. She's lying now, too. Mackenzie, I know you're upset right now, but it's not the time to be making up stories or blaming your stepmother for your actions. You burned our house down. It's your fault. You little monster, you did this. Oh, you're still going off to boarding school, but after this little stunt, we're gonna not gonna wait to send you off. I'll ship you off tonight. Huh? Where is that coming from? Honey, is that you? Ha! That's right. When you started screaming at Mackenzie, I recorded you. No, no, no! How could you do this? How could you speak to my daughter that way? I told you so. No, no, please. Don't believe her. You don't even have proof that that. Wow, I am 
so sorry. I didn't believe you, Mackenzie. We're over. Get out of here before I call the police on you. You stupid little brat. You ruined my plans. You haven't seen the last of me. I'll be back. Can't fire insurance. Right, Dad? Uh-oh. So thank you guys so much for watching. And congratulations to Ariel Ellis for being our post notification winner. If you guys want to be our next post notification winner, all you have to do is turn those post notifications on and comment down.